Well, hello there, friends and family. You might wonder what old Mr. Tom's up to. Well, we got the kitty crew ball here. And it's uh, crispy cold outside. 42 currently. And there are times when I feel it's necessary to serve up the kitty crew a warm meal too. And I cooked them up some liver scraps I had. They truly enjoy. And I got them some kibble in their bowl. And we're going to also include some of their frisky shreds. Turkey and cheese dinner and gravy. And we're going to whip them up something hot and ready to warm them up on this cool, crisp winter day. Yeah, we are. Right, Gracie? Yeah, Gracie, she's just whining because she wants friskies. Ooh, look at that steam come off. Yep, it's ready. So, we got to give them some friskies in there first. You know, they're not all that particular. Food's food. They won't notice. I'll just tell them it's a mulligan stew. And they'll be just fine with it. So we'll add that on in there. And then we'll add in this nice warm liver scraps. And it's broth. Let it warm up some. I think I'll get a little more. Kibble to throw on in there, make it a little thicker so it makes some gravy. Now, if you listen closely, you might hear Gracie. She's begging. She's got food in her bowl, and she still wants to think she needs something. So we'll get that all mixed up for her. Let it cool some, not a lot. We'll let her get down to where it won't burn me. And of course, Gracie's not gonna let up till she gets something. So we'll give her some, what is this? Friskies, ocean, white fish and tuna. That be okay, Gracie? Your tail's going. Yep. Vibrate. So, we'll fix Gracie up now. She's not particular as long as it's friskies or fancy feast. You know. She is the queen. That'll keep her quiet for a while. Try to fatten the old girl up some. Well, she's not an old girl. She's a little queen. So let's see if Gracie is hungry. Gracie! Gracie! Oh, come on! Come on, come on, you want it, hmm? Oh, you do, you do, okay, there you go, there's yours, okay, that make you happy? Lord knows we wouldn't want you to think you were going out, would we? Well, now we have to go outdoors, so I got to get zipped up a little bit. Yep, find my shoes and head out and fix up the kitty crew if you don't mind. Be okay? Hmm? We'll be okay. That tail, 
Got it curled. <laughs> you and your tail. Are you the queen? Hmm. You want to say anything? To your viewers and fans? Because it was a very nice viewer and fan and yours and the kitty crew that sent you those friskies. Huh. Oh. You're too busy enjoying? Well, at least you listen better than the kids. And Papa always says, don't eat with your mouth full. Even though sometimes during those taste tests, I tend to get a little carried away. Speak before I got it all chewed up and swallowed, don't I? Yeah, sometimes you just forget your manners, don't you? Okay, baby. Well, I'm going to leave that with you. And we're going to go out and feed the kitty crew some liver and turkey and kibble stew. Warm up from the inside, okay? You want to come out with me? No, nah, I don't think so. You didn't want to come out this morning either, did you? <laughs> you sit at the door and watch. You're a mess, girl. But I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. I love you, I love you. You'll come love Papa later. Okay. Enjoy, dear. Well, hello, guys. What's going on, Miss Cleo? Speedy? Spooky? Are y'all ready? Are y'all ready for some hot and ready kitty stew? Okay, watch it. It might still be a little too warm, okay? Don't crowd me. Don't crowd me. Okay. <laughs> Not sure about that, huh? <laughs> Speedy, you're not a fan of liver. It might be a little bit too warm. Still. Y'all aren't stupid. It's just barely warming my body. I know. A little strange, huh? It's okay. <laughs> it's not your favorite, Spooky? Or are you just giving uh, Cleo lots of room? I think you're just giving Cleo lots of room. Cleo ain't minding. Of course, she is the queen out here. Huh. They keep looking around their shoulder. Wonder if Mr. Gray's around. Uh-oh. Sun's coming out. Yep, there it went. We haven't seen it in a few days. Cleo, you don't mind it, do you? <laughs> You've been steady going at it. Mother, too. Speedy and Spooky. I guess they're just too particular. But you're liking it. Woo. What's up, Speedy? What? What you see? Birdies? It may only be 42, which compared to yesterday is a heat wave. And when that wind gusts up, whew, Spooky wants some. But I guess he just knows Queen's eating now. So until she's finished, he's going to give him the room. 
Yep, Speedy's wanting to play with Big Brother. There they go. Get him, get him, Speedy. You got him down. Stay on top, girl. Whoop him. Don't worry, y'all. Spooky won't hurt her. <laughs> She's in control. <laughs> Get him, Speedy. Whoop him good. Show Big Brother who's boss. <laughs> She's got you in the kitty grip now, Spooky. Uh-oh. <laughs> they go with this all day long. Those two are inseparable. And they have been since. Oh, if y'all remember, when Cleo had to go to the vet. And uh, Speedy there, along with her little sister, Gracie, and Crow, her brother, were here. Spooky took care of them. And they were just little bitty things then. Probably eight weeks old. Never left their side. Now, Crow, he's living in Montgomery now with two little girls. He's a city cat. And, of course, had to bring Gracie in. Cause she was the little thing and she don't even make up barely two thirds of the size of Speedy and Speedy's smaller than Spooky her older brother and they love that tree of course that was one of Trixie's favorite trees too and Merlin's and Cabby Doo's Shana Lee's and the list goes on of all the past furry friends we've had here. Well, I'm starting to shiver. The camera's starting to shake. And the sun went behind the clouds again. But I just thought I'd share with you making up a little treat for the kitty crew on this here cold, chilly, crisp day. In January. Today. You're not complaining, are you, Cleo? You love Pop's cooking. Now, I think the other two will get after it more. When, uh, you finish up. And I know you can't see it. Don't got enough zoom on these GoPros. Speedy and Spooky are way up in that tree, jumping from branch to branch, having a big old time. Well, y'all, until we see you on the next video, y'all take care out there. Stay safe. Stay warm. And may God bless each and every one of you as you bless others. Goodbye for now. Cleo. You heading back on down to the neighbors? I see how you are. I said I was going in. So you're going to call it a day too, huh? Okay, well, at least with you down there. Speedy and Spooky will be able to come up. Enjoy some of the Kitty Crew stew too before it gets too cold. Yeah, I'm shaking too much. Time to go in, y'all. Like I say, stay warm. Later, all. Well, Gracie, you ain't finished all of that. Oh, well, you just came out. Check that, me, huh? See what I was giving them outside? So now you go back to eating yours? Okay. Your papa's baby. Don't tell Cleo I said that. Oh, we're spooky or speedy, okay? Or Magoo. Elrod. Mr. Gray. Heathcliff. They'll all get jealous, right? If you're a good girl, you might get some treats. 
Okay.